Hey loves, what's up? This is a really short haul, but I figured I would film it anyway because you guys have been, <laughs> Luna's here, you can see her tail. Luna is here. Who doesn't like a day with Luna? Hello. So today <laughs> I ended up picking up like four things from Bloom Chic for like, I was gonna use them in a spooky lookbook or spooky photos and I honestly totally spaced it and didn't feature them in anything yet so I decided I would just do this little haul for you guys that way I can kind of test the waters and see if I should do a full haul from them if you have not heard of Bloom Chic they are a newer affordable plus size only company and the most exciting thing about them is that by January I think I think by January 2022 I'll put the exact info in the description box down below um, if you can't find it it's just that little tiny arrow next to the title just click that if you're on mobile, it's you, it's really hard to find, but it's down there. Um, they're expanding to a size 30, which I think is amazing because they have like Shein prices and they're gonna be a little bit more inclusive, which I love. It is super duper affordable. And when I first looked into it, my first thought was like, is this just like a plus size Shein? And honestly down to, hold on, down to their bags. <laughs> Like, I don't know if they're the same company. It would seem pretty silly if they were the same company. They might just be a company trying to be like Shein. I'm not sure when you are a plus size woman, finding affordable, trendy clothing, me being able to go on any website and look for something, like something completely random. I can be like, I want a dress with strawberries on it. And you know what? I'm gonna go on Shein. I'm gonna find it. If I'm gonna like, if I look and see some beautiful, you know, straight size woman wearing something, uh, and if it's from Shein, most likely they're going to either have the exact same thing in plus size or, you know, something similar. And I love that. So I love that Bloom Chic has come out because they are, of course, still growing. They are new, but you can see their stuff expanding every single day and they have such cute stuff. What I did love about the Halloween stuff in particular, they did carry it in like all sizes, not up to a 30 yet because again that's coming in 2022 but they had it up to a size 22 almost everything goes to a size 22 which is one size up from Shein already so if you want to shop at Shein but you haven't been able to definitely track out Bloom Chic I'll just tell you that now before we even jump into this haul sorry for that ramble but I feel like because I've never done a haul with them before I need to give you a little bit more info a little bit of a background story but we're gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and jump in and show you these four items that I picked up everything was a win spoiler alert spoiler alert if I can speak <laughs> so anyway we're gonna go ahead and jump in please subscribe if you haven't already I upload videos every Monday Wednesday Friday we do beauty plus size fashion food videos vlogs stuff like that if you're into it you are in the right place subscribe let's be friends all right let's do this so so I am normally usually a US 20 or a size 22 and I think most things I actually got in a size 22 and then the first item the dress that I'm going to show you I did get in a size 20 and it worked great. I think that a 20 would have worked on any of them like I think that it would have been totally fine had I gotten everything in a size 20 but certain items I like to be a little bit looser so I went with the size 22 plus I'm kind of like in between the sizes right now. Some places it was 20, some places it's 22, you know, plus that's just women's fashion. It's just like that. But just so you guys get a general size reference of, you know, and plus at, at Shein, I normally order a 4X. So if you're kind of comparing, I hope that helps. And then I am 5'9", so I am on the taller side. So again, this is a pretty short haul. There's only four items, but I didn't want to not show them to you. The whole reason I made the haul was this dress. What's funny is now looking at the picture, it kind of looks purpley. When I ordered it, I thought it was like a deep royal purple, but it is kind of more of a deep royal blue with like purple undertones. Like it's very in between. Oh my gosh, you guys, it's so cute. I don't even think I remember there being the cross in the middle. I can easily cut that off if I want to. I have dresses very similar to this, like little velvet cami dresses from Shein that I'm absolutely obsessed with. I love that the top fit my bust. My bust is on the smaller side. So the fact that I felt like it wasn't loose with like such a like kind of structured cup going, you know, but it fit good. But I do think if you have a larger bust, you're still gonna be able to get them in there. But I think that the little bit of elastic just helped kind of form to my bust, if you know what I'm saying. Uh, this is a little bit longer. It's more of a midi instead of a mini, which I don't really mind either way. I kind of like the extra length sometimes. And the color of this is just absolutely so stinking gorgeous. I love this. I will wear this anytime, especially if I take off the little cross. I feel like it'll be a little bit less spooky. I actually brought everything down so you guys can see it. Um, yeah, even I feel like on screen it just looks more purple, but it definitely leans more royal blue. 
It's so cute and comfy. I think this is adorable. I'm obsessed with it. This is so my vibe. I love the eyelash lace at the bottom. It's definitely very comparable to what you would find at Shein or Romway. I love it. I love it. There's like this, there's that, um, that like no slip stuff on the bust to keep it in place. Even this little like cross is, it's metal. It's not plastic. I thought it would be plastic. Ah, I love it. I love, I love, I love. So here's what she looks like on this camera. I just wanted you to see, I love the little lace detail around the bust as well. So stinking cute, 10 out of 10. And what was cool is I ordered this. Honestly, I kind of did a boo-boo. <laughs> I ordered it, okay. And I got a text message and I was half asleep and I, without even thinking, responded to them. They literally texted me and said, this was out of stock. Well, they just said an item was out of stock. Did I want to, you know, just refund it or what did I want to do? And I was half asleep and I was like, just refund it. And then I realized that it was the dress. And then I tried to like stop it and I was too late. And someone from customer service literally worked with me to get this dress back ordered without shipping. They had me process the order and then they refunded the shipping and gave me the discount code like on that too that I had. So customer service at Bloom Chic, I am super impressed with and I got experience on the first order and I love this dress and I'm so glad they did that because I was like, oh no, now I have to order it. This was the whole reason I did the order and I didn't wanna have to reorder and pay shipping again and all of that. So I'm excited. They also, I think their first return is free. They're very much Shein vibes. You know, because Shein used to do that. Shein, I think, does free returns all the time in the U.S. now, but I could be crazy. But, you know, I like that. I like I like when returns are simple. All right, you guys. This guy I was also really excited about. So that dress I got in a size 20. This one I got in the 22. And I think it was a good choice. <laughs> Look how cute this is. I love stuff like this year-round. So, I mean, this was part of their, like, Halloween vibes but I will wear this any time of year. The moons are what got me. Obviously I love skulls but they put skulls and stars and moons together and it's black and pink. Oh my goodness. Yeah I had to get it. I had to get it. I was like I just need that. I need it. So oh just kidding. It says it's a size 20. What the heck? I thought I got this. <laughs> I really thought I got this in a size 22 so I'm glad I have it down here. Now you guys know this is a size 20 a size 2XL, which I do like that they do that because most places like Walmart and Target, if you go there and you look at a size 2X, it's going to be like an 1820. And some places have made that completely different, like how a, a size 20 is a 4X at Shein. I do like that it's actually more like what you're used to seeing, at least in America. Um, now I'm even more impressed by it because I just assumed it was a size up and that's why it was so comfy. But I probably could have worn this in a size smaller if I wanted to. But I do like the little bit of extra room. Now, I'm, I'm, well, whatever the world worked, it works in mysterious ways. This is perfect in the size that it is. Uh, the inside is just blank white, which whatever, no one's gonna ever see that. Uh, it zips really nicely. It's a nice length. It's on the shorter side, but not too short. Oh, there's even little like constellations on here. Oh, it's so cute. It's so cute. I am. I really like this. I feel like they had multiple ones, but this was the one that really spoke to me, especially because it was kind of my year round vibe. I will wear stuff like this year round. I'm actually half emo kid, just so you guys know, I'm an elder millennial and I will forever, plus I worked at Hot Topic for forever. So that's just like ingrained in my soul. Even though like, if you just looked at me, <laughs> what I'm actually wearing, you would not guess that. Uh, yeah, I'm all about it, all about it. Super impressed with this guy too. This is the only one that surprised me, but I probably should have read it better. I originally got this guy to pair with the dress. I thought it'd be a really cute little sweater to wear with it. It said t-shirt, so I assumed it was just like t-shirt material, but it's legit like a faux cardigan. It's all one piece. It's super soft and stretchy. This one is in a US 22. It's got the little bats on the right here on the shoulder. And then it's got little spider webs on both arms. This is so soft, it's so soft. And you can see how stretchy it is. So this is really cute. I normally wouldn't wear a cardigan like this button. I might pop this honestly up on Poshmark. I'm not sure yet. Uh, Cause I don't, I, I know myself and I know I probably won't wear it. I bought it thinking it was a cardigan type of situation. Uh, it's super cute, super comfy. It's only me knowing that I won't probably wear it. But if you like it and you think you would wear it, 
it's really good. And again, you can probably go with like what you would normally order. I just never know. When I order from somewhere new, I just like to be safe. Plus again, with the comfort, I'd rather just like when I'm in between sizes, I go with the bigger size just cause I'm, I want to be, you know, golden. So that again, super soft, super comfy, just a little weird cause I thought it was a cardigan, but I like it. I keep wanting to say this is literally, I loved the dress is my favorite because I'm gonna wear that any time of year, anytime, and I can't wait to wear it and dress it up with maybe like a motor jacket or something for a cute date night. Uh, yeah, I can't wait to wear that dress. But this guy, oh my goodness. I feel like everything like this at Shein only went to a 2X. And I'm always nervous, even though sometimes their 2Xs or 3Xs run a little bit big when stuff only goes to a certain size. I've noticed that because like anytime like a cardigan or a sweater or something like that has gone to a 3X on Shein. Sorry that I'm comparing them so much, but they really, they're very similar. They are very similar. Or if you're, if you're a Shein shopper, you're going to like Bloom Chic. If you're Bloom Chic, you're going to like Shein, you know? Stuff like that was like basic, more basic spooky stuff like this, like didn't come in the right size. And they didn't have a lot in the plus sizes that were more like black and white or stuff that I feel like I could wear all year round. As long as it doesn't have a pumpkin on it or say Halloween, I'll wear it anytime. That's moons forever and always, like moons and stars and suns forever and always. That's not even Halloween. It's just plumped in there but bats and witches and stuff like that I will forever love all times of year but especially bats I think when it comes to clothing bats besides moons and stars I love bats it's freaking bats okay uh this one is a size 22 as well I think that that was the right move on this it is kind of out of that shiny material that happens sometimes you never know when it's gonna happen but it happens and I it's so cute that I don't even care like it's fine and it's still so soft and comfy like it's the soft silky material uh it is white on the inside but let me see if you have, if like if it's too small, it is gonna kind of do that. But again, I ordered a size up and I think had I just gotten a size 20, it would have been fine too. Yeah, yeah. You would have to like, it would have to be really tight to show that. So kudos to that because I hate when stuff isn't all over print and then the it's actually printed on white and it's black and it looks all funky like that super easily. But I think this one's gonna be just fine. Again, super soft, comfy, bloom chic, heck yeah. Super excited. I'm gonna wear this any time of year. This is a little spooky haul, but you just gotta, sometimes you just wear stuff, I don't know, be spooky. Spooky is a lifestyle. I embrace it in, like, in October, especially on Instagram. I'm all about all the spooky outfits, and all of October on Instagram is pretty much, I would say. I have a couple things that might go up that weren't actually Halloween-y, but, you know, the vibes, the vibes are there. But anyway, I feel like I'm rambling. I've been filming for almost 15 minutes and this is a very small haul. Um, all right, love. So that is everything. I will do my best to link everything down below. Hopefully some of it is still available. I'm sorry that it is Halloween-y fashion. I literally just got the dress though. Yeah, I'm excited. I can't wait to try more stuff from them. Their selection is decent right now. I, I feel like when you compare it in your head to like Shein, it feels smaller, but I know that they're expanding. And honestly, the fact that they're gonna be more inclusive I really do. I think that's great. I think we really need that. I don't think that it's fair to so many women out there that are, you know, a size 24, a 26, a size 30, whatever, that can't find the same things that, you know, I can at a size 20 or 22. Like, it's just not fair. Um, I'm very blessed to be able to find what I can, but I just want, I want everyone to be able to find whatever they want. All right, guys, I'm really going to stop rambling now. I think Bloom Chic is awesome. I will definitely order from there again. Let me know if you want another haul from them and what you want to see. Do you just want like a fall haul? Um, kind of fall winter. That would be fun. I'll keep an eye out. And again, starting in January 2022, they are going to carry up to a size 30. I don't know exactly what that looks like. They haven't given a bunch of details on it. I'm hoping that that means like every item will go up to that. And again, they are right now carrying up to a 22 in pretty much everything that I looked at. So yeah. Okay. I'm gonna stop rambling. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Share it if you could. And again, let me know if you want to see more Bloom Chic. All right. I love you guys so much. I will talk to you soon. Bye. <laughs> She's sliding. I want to show you the clothing, but I don't know how I'm going to show it to you when I've got to hold the Luna butt. Uh, <laughs>